Say hi from Charish Math. This is a question. Find the square root of 8 plus 2 multiplied the square root of 12. Before I start to solve this problem, I would like to discuss the expansion of the quadratic formula. a plus b squared is the same as a plus b multiplied with a plus b. And now, I need to expand it. And the thing that I'm going to get here is a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. In order to make this equation simpler, I can just equate it directly like this. Which means a plus b squared up is equal a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. By using back something similar to this equation, I'm going to replace the a plus b with the square root of a plus the square root of the b. And I'm going to square up the whole thing. And what I'm going to get here will be the square root of the a, I'm going to square it up. Simply substitute the value of a as square root of a plus 2. So the value of a now is actually the square root of a. And the value of the b now is the square root of the b. And the value of b is the square root of the b, and I squared it up. So, what am I going to get here? Square root of a squared up is offset. So, what left is just a alone. Plus 2, the square root of a multiplied the square root of b is the entire square root of a, b. Plus offset the square root with the square and I got just b. Now, if I rearrange this formula, that would just be, I take this away, and I just put it up. And this is the answer. Based on this rule, I'm going to use it on the problem here. Since this is a question, 8 plus 2 multiplied the square root of 12 and square root the entire thing. The first thing I need to do is to spot for what is the values of a and b. It seems that in this square root, in the bracket that I'm putting up here, we are unable to find for what is the value of a and the value of b because there's no repeating numbers within the bracket. Now, all I need to do is to split the numbers. A is a result of 6 plus 2 plus 2. Now, the square root of the 12 here, the number 12, I can use 6 multiplied by 2, and that is the same as the 12. In the next step, I'm going to rearrange all the numbers here. That would be 6 plus 2 square root of 6 times 2 plus 2. The way I make it so is simply by using the 2, putting it at the behind here. And let me put up the bracket here. Within the bracket, it looks very similar to the green part that I have done earlier. Now, what is the value of a? The value of a is just the square root of 6. I'm going to add up with the square root of 2, which is the value of b. And I have to square it up, the whole thing. This is the bracket. Now, on top of the bracket, there is two square root of the whole thing. I am now with the last step to solve the problem. The square root and the square, I can just offset the thing. And what left here is the square root of 6 plus the square root of 2. And we solved the puzzle. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.